A fire has broken out at the world-famous Paris landmark Notre Dame Cathedral. The cause is not clear. The fire broke out in the last hour. Officials say it could be linked to renovation work going on at the 850-year-old cathedral. Bands of firefighters are tackling the billowing flames. You see the images there from Paris. The area around the central Paris location has been cleared. Christian Malard joins me now over the phone from Paris. And Christian, obviously a developing story. What else do we know at this point? Well, uh, normally you, you are mentioning the renovation, which we are underground right now. There is, according to the various sources of networks, uh, it could be something accidental uh, getting in the underground part of the cathedral. Uh, hold on a second. I am New York. Yeah, New York is calling. I-24 News, New York is calling me also. Uh, and uh, the, the, the policeman and the fire brigade uh, people keep telling me right now uh, that uh, it might last quite a lot of time. So it's a big fire. Uh, definitely it's very impressive because it's Notre Dame Cathedral, which is one of the most visited areas in the world. And it can be the renovation, but we, we have no confirmation it's coming from there. Uh, what, let me tell you one thing. There is no certainty about what I'm going to tell you, but these last few months, in Paris and some suburbs, churches uh, have been the target of some people who wanted to put them on fire. So we know that uh, that the terrorist uh, movements, terrorist organizations, even like Daesh, uh, who definitely changed his strategy and is coming to Europe, uh, it might be, I say, I am very careful, it might right, be a possibility and because the churches have been the, really the targets of many terrorists uh, not long time ago. Yes, and Christian, as you say, the cause is not yet known, and we will, of course, uh, continue to follow. But Christian, talk to us about the location. This is a central location in Paris, and if this yeah. location is cordoned yeah. off, it must put the whole city in disorder. Yeah, exactly. A whole city in disorder. You are quite right. It's the way we, we have to qualify the situation. And, and Notre Dame is definitely right in the center of Paris. It's close to the famous Latin Quarter, where you have a lot of tourists around Notre Dame and all these areas, Boulevard Saint-Germain, known to many American friends, uh, Boulevard Saint-Michel, uh, close to Notre Dame. It's a very central touristic area where um, during this part of the year, close to Easter vacation period, and to Pesach, uh, we have a lot of tourists going around. And I can see right now, I can imagine uh, the, the panic. Uh, probably all the people, the, 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 the quarter has been cleared uh, because many tourists are there at this time of the day where the, the, it's a sunny, sunny period, very fine weather. And definitely uh, the people must have been panic stricken when they have seen uh, this very impressive fire. And as I told you previously, the fire brigade people keep saying that it might be uh, lasting for a little while, which means that during the, the night uh, in Paris, uh, 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 until the situation is recovered. Uh, Christian, you mentioned the many tourists that visit uh, the church, and we're still seeing the images of that fire uh, destroying it uh, in the background as we speak. Talk to us about the historical significance of the cathedral and why it could be a target for some organizations. Well, definitely. Uh, it's the place in Paris, the, the most famous religious Catholic place in Paris, Notre Dame. When you speak about Notre Dame, people know what they talk about. And definitely uh, a few months ago, uh, if I remember, uh, they arrested seven people uh, around Notre Dame uh, with a little bus uh, with uh, explosives and already Months ago, it was linked to Islamist movement. Uh, they, they arrested the seven people who were ready uh, to prepare a terrorist attack against Notre Dame. So we cannot exclude the terrorist track, definitely. I don't mean it is a, a terrorist attack, but definitely Notre Dame has been, it's not the first time, has been the target of terrorist organizations like Daesh, or even Al Qaeda, but I would more say that I would more I would be more tempted to say ISIS, 
so we will see the the oncoming the ongoing development of the situation but it might be also accidental as we said uh, because of the renovation it's clear right now that the big part of the cathedral is under renovation at the top and at the, at, at the underground part so it might be a possibility also but it's true yes. that at this part of the day uh, it, it's very impressive for all the people who are in the area yes christian malau thank you so much for being with us so quickly the fire breaking out Thank <laughs> you.